The Pro Hero Edge shot has finally joined the My Hero Ultra Impact roster and along with his addition to the game, we have a new event, a Ninja's Home Security. Today, we are gonna be taking on Ultra Difficulty as well as Extreme Difficulty. Hopefully, we'll be Ultra Difficulty on the first try and then we'll see if we're able to be Extreme within, you know, ideally, it would be three turns, but I don't really read the strategy info because I'm lazy and it's just no fun to read the strategy info. It ruins it. I'd rather try to figure out the strategy on my own. It makes it a lot more fun. So we're gonna do Ultra and then Extreme and try to get Extreme done in three turns but realistically it'll probably take me like five to six because I don't pick the optimal team, but we'll just have to see. This is the team I'm going to be using to attempt ultra. If it goes well on ultra, then we will take this team over to extreme. Basically my idea is we're just going to heal and do lots of damage. So let's see how it goes. Edge shot has 590,000 health. I'm not gonna lie, when I took him on on easy, normal, and hard, even hard was really easy. Like I think I finished hard in one or two turns. I don't even think I made it to the plus ultra turn before I won. So we'll see how hard ultra actually is. We're gonna go ahead and we'll boost with Yairozu. I don't really care who we boost. We'll do this and then we'll do this. 49,000 from Deku. He did resist the stun from our Araka. I will go ahead and do this, this, and this. And the plus ultra turn is gonna be the big turn. We'll see how much damage we actually do that turn, but I feel like we've already done a good amount of damage in two turns. Like, that's a lot of damage. All right, we'll go ahead and use all of our plus ultras here. Monoma probably won't do a lot. Yeah, he didn't really do much. Deku did 99,000. Yeah, Yairozu did 59,000. Or Rocket did 54,000. Okay, pretty good overall. This team's just gonna absolutely survive no matter what. They, does Edshot do anything? It feels like he's just a punching bag, honestly. It doesn't feel like he's doing a whole lot. Okay, and there we go. Easy peasy. Ultra was really, really easy. Now, I don't think that was like maximizing the amount of damage I could be doing necessarily. So I might have to try switching my team up on extreme to see if I can get a little bit more damage. I have completely switched my team up. I haven't even attempted extreme yet, but now my goal is to see if I can do a lot of damage. I think Kirishima will probably be pretty good in this. Najire with her evasion and healing. So we still have two healers. We should still survive. And now we have a tank. Let's see how it goes. He has 10 million health exactly. That number looks kind of intimidating when you with all the zeros. Like in the past, it hasn't been like an exact number like that. That is a lot of health. All right, I'm gonna try not to miss my my counter with Kirishima here. It feels like it's been a hot minute since I've used Fantasy Kirishima. All right. Okay, good. I did not miss the counter. I'm kind of proud of myself. A lot of times I'll miss that counter. Ooh, that 30,000 counter damage is good. It's so good. Okay, so we've done a little over 200,000 damage already. That's solid. Ooh, Ninjure is doing damage too. Okay, we're, I think we're in a very good, very good place in terms of damage. We'll go ahead and use all of our plus ultras here and the friend plus ultra. 76,000 from the friend. 99,000 from Ninjure. 99,000 from Deku. And 99,000 from Kirishima. Okay, this team, this team might be the way to go. Uh, oh, I should have put an action skill cooldown memory on them. Oh, well, it'll be fine. Shouldn't be a big deal. Okay, now we go ahead and counter, and we'll just do the skill chain again. One dead turn is not the worst thing. Ideally, though, you don't want any dead turns, but still, that's not, that's not bad. Oh my gosh, the counters, dude. Those are going to get us through this so quickly. All right, we've already done a million damage. That's pretty good. That's pretty dang good. We are on turn seven, so we're about halfway after this turn right here. We'll see where we're at. Right, we will have evasion now, which is good, so we can evade his plus ultra potentially, unless he has bullseye. I'm not sure if he does. Uh, he did not, so there we go, solid. All right, we do have a dead turn here. 
not a big deal. And now just rinse and repeat. This team actually works pretty well. Oh, I almost missed that tap right there. I got really nervous that I was going to miss that tap right there. 50,000 on a counter, my guy. Calm down, Kirishima. We're almost up to 2 million damage. Another 200,000 damage and we'll have done 2 million. All of our plus ultras right here will be able to dodge his plus ultra again. This team actually works out like exactly right for dodging his plus ultra and everything. Okay, another dead turn. We have already done a full 2 million damage. We've done 2,100,000 damage. Doesn't matter, Kirishima's too tanky for you, my guy. Oh my gosh, and we're going to end with a plus ultra turn as long as I don't mess up my taps here. Really good damage overall. So it looks like we're going to get like maybe maybe close to 3 million damage. I'm going to say more like 2,700,000 is my guess. We'll see how much it exactly is in the end. All right, so now we got all of our plus ultras coming in. Ninety-nine thousand. Another ninety-nine thousand, and hopefully a third set of ninety-nine thousand. Beautiful. Uh, Two million eight hundred and twenty thousand, I think, is roughly where we're at at the end of this. We'll see. But that's really good. Yeah, two two million eight hundred and thirteen thousand damage in one run. That is insanely good. So I'm going to do a couple more runs here. When we get to the last run, I will update you guys on how many tries it took us. This is my highest damage run so far. I did 3,058,939 damage in one singular run. So far, as you can see, I have only done three tries. So on the fourth try right now, we are going to complete this extreme difficulty. This has been actually the easiest extreme difficulty i i think i've done so far edge shot i'm sad to sad to say it but he's a bit of a pushover hopefully uh when i test out his character in pvp and in climax battle and stuff like that that won't be the case but right now in this event as a boss he's not much of a boss which i'm okay with because it's easy farm easy tickets and easy hero lottery right so that's good for us we're gonna go ahead and counter we'll do this and then we'll do this hopefully i don't miss my tap again Okay, good. And it will probably take us, what, about six turns maybe to finish up a million health? Maybe a little bit more. We'll see. Use all of these. Ooh, 67,000 damage from that. Nice. And we're hitting... Let's hope we hit crits with all of our plus ultras. That'd be amazing. Crit here. Ooh, 37,000. Yes, those counters are big, guys. I'm telling you. All right, we'll go ahead and plus ultra with the friend. The friend hit a crit last time, too. This time he didn't. 99,000. Ooh, we missed that crit right there. Last time I hit all crits on all plus ultras too to get that 3 million damage. So if we're not hitting those crits, definitely not hitting those same damage numbers, but that's fine. All right, we'll go ahead and counter. Boom, boom, boom. And it'll take us, what, about one, maybe two turns. I think it's going to take us two turns. Uh, yeah, most definitely going to take us one more turn after this. So on our plus ultra turn, we're about to win. 140,000 health left for edge shots. 51,000 and one plus ultra, and he is finished. Extreme difficulty is about to be done. Thank you, Najire. Finish him off with the rainbow at the end beautiful i cannot stress enough that this was so easy like this was the easiest extreme i think i have ever done in ultra impact let me know if you guys are feeling the same way if you took on this boss down in the comments and if you guys enjoyed this video this run through please go down there hit that like button hit that subscribe button and thank you guys so much for watching peace Maybach.